But no legendary and blessed morning. This is more so for tracking purchases. It is Monday, May 8th. Is today the 8th or the 9th? Today is the 8th, yes. May 8th. And I've made it out another day. And I want to give myself, you know, a celebration, a win. Celebrate a win. That uh, when I checked my exercise app, I actually went out three times last week. Three times. With what I consider, in addition to the three, kind of a, a active day where um, I told, I think I told you guys that um, sometimes, not sometimes, literally, probably 90 95% of the time um, I opt out of taking the bus from my train station to home and I just walk it which is at least a mile so even if I don't actually work out that day I'm walking for at least a mile now that might not seem like a lot <laughs> and that's all good but at least I'm getting my joints moving you know from sitting all day I did a little walking um, and now what I'm thinking about doing is on that day, <clears throat> consider going to the track and just walking, not necessarily, um, doing any exercise or even just walking the neighborhoods, you know, and walk back, you know, enough that I feel like I broke a little sweat. I got a little bit of a burn, but it's not an actual like workout day. So I'm proud of myself. And I did not go out yesterday because I did work out Thursday and Friday. That was part of my three days from last week. So today I'm out. The hope is that uh, I would get out um, three more times this week because I would like to increase to four times a week. The goal for me is to go from anywhere to at least four, four to six times a week giving myself one full rest day um, where I'm not working out. But even if I'm active, it kind of counts. But I'm proud of myself. And you should be proud of you for whatever you've been working on and you started to create some consistency in. Don't be so hard on yourself. If you got something done, celebrate. Maybe you've been watching your intake of food it doesn't have to be a lot small cup of ice cream couple of cookies nothing big nothing too heavy nothing that you'll regret tomorrow or that you feel like you'll have to um oh do a whole workout for just because you feel this guilt nah celebrate yourself did you start writing the book did you I don't know, start going to church. Matter of fact, this past Sunday, I hadn't physically been to church for a few weeks, might be even a whole month. Um, but I went yesterday. I plan on going regularly as I was going before. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, you know, that's another win. I made it to church yesterday. Um, and it was a really good day, a productive day. So, Give yourself the win. We got to celebrate the small stuff because when the, the big stuff come, you won't, you won't really know how to celebrate. You'll feel like you always got to do more. Can there always be more done? Sure. But you got to celebrate the small stuff that you got taken care of. If you got something checked off your list, be proud of yourself. You got something off your list. That's great. So I'm tuning out y'all. Oh, phenomenal, legendary and blessed morning. If I didn't tell you. And uh, I'm sending you love, life, and light in Christ. Let's go.